The most exciting thing for me as well reading about Upland was this concept of kind of freeing up time. We are studying the normal distribution, and so that was the bit of Upland that I had set them to do over half term. But we covered, I don't know, twice as much in the, in the one lesson, I think, as we would have been able to if they hadn't watched the Upland videos and kind of pre-prepared for those lessons using Upland. Schools have a responsibility to prepare young people for the world beyond. Particularly sixth form subjects feel that responsibility more acutely. And I think Uplearn is a, a very structured way for them to be independent. I think for the students, the, the best aspect of Uplearn is the ability to assess yourself and for Uplearn to learn the various parts of the course you are confident in and less confident in and adapt its testing to that. And I think students find that really helpful. Every single example is related to something in the real world and so maths has this kind of purpose or use. We've had students who have reported back to us that it's been useful for them and it's supported their revision and their learning enough that we'll stick with Uplearn for the foreseeable future. I think Uplearn can offer more to for varieties of learners than uh, a traditional textbook or a traditional lesson delivery or traditional homework sheet and that's why Upland's very good for um, consolidation outside the classroom for our students.